Hi, my name is Dr. Akhtar and I am the Chief Gastroenterology Fellow at the University of British Columbia, Vancouver, Canada. I am honored to present this case of Rosé Dorfman de Stombe disease, a rare histiocytic neoplasm that can often present with extranodal involvement. This is a case of a 54-year-old male presented with abdominal pain and jaundice with no evidence of lymphadenopathy or chronic liver disease on exam. His initial investigations reveal elevated liver chemistry with a polyclonal hypergammaglobulinemia. His initial CT demonstrated marked intrahepatic and extrahepatic biliary dilation with a diffusely enlarged pancreas. Subsequent ERCP confirmed a distal CBD stricture with fine needle biopsies of his pancreas showing active and chronic inflammation with no IgG4 positive plasma cells. A diagnosis of autoimmune pancreatitis was made, and the patient was started on steroids with an initial response. However, six months later, he represented with significant weight loss and diffuse lymphadenopathy. An excisional biopsy now showed expansion of the sinuses with histiocytes and lymphocytic emperopalysis, findings compatible with rosé Dorfman disease. The patient was then initiated on rituximab with complete resolution of his symptom and continues to do well one year out. Obstructive jaundice, as we all know, is a very common clinical scenario that has a broad differential. This includes stones, cysts, or strictures secondary to PSC, autoimmune pancreatitis, or malignancy. Rosy Dorfman disease of the pancreas is a great mimicker and masquerader of these conditions and should always remain on our differential. Thank you.